See that synergy, baby? Mm. No, you, you can't get that synergy, dude. It takes takes many, many, many years. Um, which is what shows like that turn into. Like I know, I've, like I that happens with those animes too. There's a, there's a bunch of animes where I start. I don't know about animes, but I'll get a season in, and then I'll know everything. I feel like I know everything that's gonna happen in a show I shouldn't know, and it's boring. Like there's no depth to it. It's just straightforward. Like um, I watched uh, what's the Apple TV show? We just talked about this the other day. What's the Apple TV show with uh? Sedekis? Is that his name? Whatever his name is in it. Yeah, Ted Lasso. Like, Ted Lasso is an amazing fucking show. Like, one of the best shows I've ever watched. Literally one HP, Ripster. Nice. Ted Lasso is it about an American coach that goes and coaches a football team uh, overseas where he doesn't know shit about football. But it's like, it, it's not about soccer and football. It's about everything else. Like, there's an immense amount of, like, drama and story and emotion in it. It's really fucking good. The acting in it is really, really, really fucking good. They character build, like, perfectly, too. There's characters in that where you, you, you know, like they you start off and you really like them and then maybe you don't later. There's ones that you might not like so much that you'll love later. Like it's crazy. What PC do I recommend? Go on Zydax and custom pick out your parts and they'll build it for you and it'll be perfect. Sons of Anarchy, I got three seasons in and got kind of bored. I don't think that show's bad though. I think... It's more just what its core is about. I think I just got over it pretty quick. S tier shows movies. Uh, I think Vikings is a top tier show. I think Ted Lasso is probably like top one or two. I think Last Kingdom is probably one or I'd probably argue that with Ted Lasso be one or two. Uh, my favorite show of all time for me personally is Jericho. Because I like end of the world type shit, apocalyptic shit. Uh, I don't know. I'd have to see a list. I've seen most stuff. I've seen like everything, or at least got decently into everything to have an opinion. I thought The Witcher was good, but not great. I watched Mr. Robot two seasons, I think. Um, I stopped watching it for no reason though. Like I didn't dislike it. I just n forgot about it and never went back and watched it. The circumstances are quite unfortunate. I've probably watched more. Like that's the other thing. People always have these really strong opinions, but they only watch the things they love. I watch everything like i've watched more movies and tv than you're you know i probably should have than your average person has jericho is great no one saw it though yeah i mean i watched it started watching it for the first time in high school our uh our history teacher would put it on on like off days and then i wa ended up watching the whole thing at home swat's good swat's pretty good swat uh in the season i'm in which is like five or six is just like it's very repetitive that's another issue with shows they get repetitive on accident like they don't it's not like word for word or event to event exact repetition but it's really fucking close I've watched a decent amount of Euphoria, not straight because Sammy watches it. I've, I've seen it from when she's watching it. It's all right. Dark? I don't know what dark is. Val, that's 100% true. 100%. I like another really good show is The Rookie. 
It's a cop show, but it's another one of those ones that they do really good at getting into a different type of drama and emotion than than like a normal cop show. Nine one one's really good because it's kind of you can almost watch them separate. Like yes, if you watch it, you you get more of the character building, but you can almost watch the episode separate, and they are kind of out there and come up with pretty cool ideas. I've watched a lot of Grey's Anatomy. That shit gets so boring. There's too many seasons. I don't know how they like people watch that shit still. The Rookie's your favorite show. That's a good show. I watch all the whenever a new episode comes on. Watch that shit. Ted Lasso's like re like for me. I don't I don't see how someone go watch that and not be crazy in the Ted Lasso. I'm gonna be honest with you. Oh, I'm trolling. Ted Lasso, if you're not like, if you're watching it by yourself or you're not watching and trying to be a big man, like that shit will make you tear up. Like there's there's really good parts of that show. The uh the main female actress in that, I'm pretty sure she won a bunch of awards. Good doctor. What's the? Is that the one with uh, the doctor who's like autistic? I've seen a lot of that. That's a really good show. I got caught up on that though, and then I know a new season came out. I never watched it. The One Hundred is a great show, but has a bad season. I think it's season three or something was trash. Three or four. One of the seasons was terrible. It's like it worth skipping. Oh, the Resident. That's the. That, is that the one? No, Resident. I've seen too. Resident's really good. The actor in the Resident, the main dude, is a is a pretty solid actor. Well, he's like the he, like the fact that he's a doctor that's more of just you know he figures out what's wrong with people and doesn't isn't a real doctor and they make it based on him almost and it's that interesting is pretty nuts to me Gank middle lane, Gank middle lane, Gank middle lane. What? okay I just got trolled is Thor bad now Thor hasn't been good for many seasons brother he's okay it's not bad Gank middle lane. They will fear me. What, dude? There's something going on. I'm pressing three, and it's not going off. Okay, I need. I need you. <sighs> Blue Mountain State is a fucking hilarious ass show. I know another show that's one of my favorite shows of all time is uh, The League. I watched that like many years after it had been out. I'd heard of it, but I thought it was just, I didn't know what it was about, so I never watched it. That's a really fucking good show. That show's fucking hilarious. Yellowstone isn't from Peacock originally. Yellowstone, oh, Yellowstone will be up in my top five shows. If you haven't watched Yellowstone, you're fucking trolling. It's like a modern, it's like a modern Western. And it's fucking nuts. Yeah, Yellowstone started on Paramount, I think. I, and I think it's still there. I think Peacock just also shows it. Modern Family's funny. That's like, if you just need a show to watch, like a filler show, you don't have anything you want to binge, then that's not a bad thing to watch. Not in the cowboy stuff. It's not really cowboy stuff. It's more of like how things are run for this massively rich company uh like company that's or family that owns land out in you know cowboy land and how the shit gets handled and there's there's drama there's action there's killing there's all kinds of shit it's fucking nuts Yellowstone is not Sons of Anarchy, nah. Enemy missing left. Just 
the character development in Yellowstone and like the actual like what the characters are is way fucking better to in my opinion. The fire giant has arrived. It also has really good actors. The actors in that show are fucking beasts. You have uh what's the what's the old guy in that show? He's like fucking one of the most well known actors there is, period. Cosner, yeah, Kevin Cosner. If Kevin, Kevin Cosner is like the main, main character, but then there's a bunch of other like pretty much main characters that are really fucking good actors. Plus there's like sex and, and boobs. It, it literally hits everybody. Like if you don't like that, you're, you probably just love Star Wars. Like that's probably, that's the only thing I can, I can come down to. You're, you're, you want to live in Star Wars land. I've seen Peaky Blinders, yeah. I forgot, I watched a, like a longer video on Pinker Binders and I forgot a whole part of that show that happened. Oh uh, no. Oh my god, why is this support everywhere? Not saying if you, you like Star Wars, but I'm saying that's probably all you like if you don't like fucking something like Yellowstone at all. Did I watch Squid Game? Yeah. Squid Game was really good. It was it was just weird. It was a, it was a weird but still appealing to like a a normal viewer base, which most shows don't do and movies can't do. Have you seen the show American Gods? I don't think so. I don't think I've ever heard of it. No, uh, the rookie's on Hulu. If, if you like, like I have, uh, Hulu's like the main one I watch it on. Hulu's got a lot of those shows. Hulu isn't in Canada? God damn, that sucks. Yeah, I use Hulu as like a TV service provider and everything. Hulu's awesome. I heard that new Chippendale is good. I am not in the mood to watch it, but I was reading about show new, newer shows and they were like, this is surprisingly amazing. Like every review of it's really positive, which is weird. Yeah, Rookie is on CBS, but it's on Hulu as soon as it's new. Hulu has like, you know, partnerships or rights or whatever. I don't know how that shit works exactly, but oh, I just got me bamboozled. Oh my God, yeah, that sucks. No, shield me! Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> I walked two feet! Step inside the arc for a two-pointer. Killing spree! You watch Blacklist? I'm like many seasons into Blacklist. Not it's a really good show, it's just a lot. Like you have to watch a lot of that. Another good show? I can't remember the name right now. It's about um, the CIA and the main character is a woman and like the second main character is like this old guy with a beard who's like Jewish. I think he's Jewish or he, he has very Jewish Jewish features. Um, Homeland. The first couple of seasons of Homeland are really, 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 really good. Like the first season is amazing. I don't remember. I, I watched like two or three seasons of that. Uh, I don't remember after like the first two seasons, but that first season I remember was so fucking good. Mm, fucking potato boy. Ultimate is down. Yeah, 
Gink. Lol. That's a double kill. Good job. <clears throat> I forgot who that was. I was like, is that Mercury under me? It was fucking best hit. Oh no, where's our team? Geb. Yeah, so watch Peaky Blinders. Good show. Designator Survivor. That's another really good show. That show is fucking awesome. I'm so sad that they took that show away because it was supposed to come back. They took it down. Someone else bought it and it was supposed to come back. And I don't know whatever happened. I don't know if COVID happened or what, but it was bought by... Fuck, was, was it bought by Netflix? It was bought by someone else. I don't remember what show it was on, but it was bought by someone else and it was going to come back and didn't. Dexter was good, but it was also extremely repetitive, but it was good. Watch the show Sherlock? With, yes, I've seen that. I don't think I watched all of it, though. Yeah, anything that's apocalyptic, I like. And then when it's actually good, it's fucking just beast mode. Just like, uh, what's the show that they... On Netflix that was about politics? Uh, and then the dude was like a child molester or something, so he got kicked off the show, and then the next season was dog shit, so it died. House of Cards, yeah. House of Cards before the dude got kicked off? That was a great fucking show. That was a crazy show, but that was great. I've seen every- I think I've seen every apocalyptic show and movie that's any good. I've seen Shit's Creek. Sammy watches it. It's okay. That just doesn't take damage. Jericho was great. I really like Jericho. Fuck, dude. No body blocks, no team. No body blocks, no team. I've never even heard of Archive 81. Supernatural is too old to watch now, in my opinion. It's really slow, and it, the graphics and everything are just so old looking. And it's just, it just takes away from it a lot. The Last Ship, I've seen The Last Ship. That has the guy from Grey's Anatomy in it, right? And he's the guy in uh, Euphoria. He's the dad in Euphoria. Last ship is really good, but nobody's fucking heard of that shit. And it has like three or four seasons. Piggy Blinder's gonna get a film? That's actually really cool. Any of the Marvel TV shows? Uh, I got, I got, you know, I didn't, I thought Loki was boring. I didn't like it. And I didn't like the one where the girl had her town or whatever. I thought that was fucking just dog shit. I thought, yeah, WandaVision I thought was dog shit. I literally thought that was one of the worst TV shows I've ever watched in my life. I don't remember the rest though. I'd have to get a, a reminder on the names of the other shows that they had. Falcon was pretty good, I think. Or maybe, maybe I think I saw it. Yeah, I think the other two I both, I liked. I thought Winter Soldier was pretty good. It was okay. Those are the two that we could almost run as standalones, right? Felt like they were kind of like action shows or movies. Uh, What's Her Name had a show too that I didn't think was very good. Thought it, or was it a movie? Was the uh, fucking Scarlett Johansson's character, was that, was that a movie or a show? I can't even remember now. Black, yeah, the Black Widow show. Was that a movie? That could have been a standalone. That was pretty boring. Yeah, that, like, that and WandaVision were the lowest of low tier to me. I what thought they were gold? dog. Last game the movie, I just hope it's good. 
Anytime they extend something, I just hope it's fucking good. Greetings. No, I watch WandaVision like pretty much back to back to back. Those shows that come out once a week, I very rarely watch them right when they come out. I usually wait a couple weeks. I'm returning to base. I thought it was terrible, period. It was not a waiting thing. I just thought it was a terrible fucking show. There was nothing about it that I thought was good. Okay, that literally- I'm dead. You- whoever that swapped to and were passing to me is a fucking idiot. Our Geb didn't even ult. Is that Ripster on Geb? No, it's not. That's why. Our Geb's just holding ult. Why are you ulting after we're dead? Nice, Mindy. Oh no, I don't think you hit that anybody. No, I, I thought Loki was terrible. I don't know how so many people like that shit. I swear you guys like stuff, not because it's good, but because it's, you know, like, it's base. Because it's Marvel. I, like, I, I fucking swear. Same with, like, Star Wars shit. Like with Star Wars, everyone talks like Star Wars is a god tier. But I remember when we were in Vegas, we needed something to do for our flight, so we went and saw um, one of the newer Star Wars movies, and it was dog shit. And everyone knows it's dog shit, but no one owns up to the fact that it's dog shit. Yeah, Star Wars fans hate the new movies, but won't talk about them. They act like they don't exist, so their their show can remain perfect. But they don't do that with any other series, ever. It's weird. And I feel like people do it with Marvel, too. Like, the Marvel TV show series are dog shit. Most of them are dog shit. But they want to act like they're good to fall in line with all their movies, because their movies were fucking beasts. Your middle tower under I haven't watched Moon Knight yet. I did hear that was good. People dick ride all of the major series because they get obsessed with the base characters and stories and then everything else applies to that to them. Like, like they're all the same to them, but they're not. Like, like you gotta be able to watch everything by itself. I saw season one of the boys, I watched two episodes of season two and it was terrible. So I stopped watching it. But I read that season three is going to be fucking nuts, apparently. So I'm going to watch season two to get caught up. Um, and then, you know, watch season three when it comes out. <clears throat> That's Achilles, I get it. You're on my nuts. You don't go on anybody else. Your team's dying. Kill this guy. Team, we're three feet away. Come on. Oh, that's stunned, dude. Unfortunate. I didn't think WandaVision's concept was interesting at all. I thought it was fucking terrible. I don't, I don't even, I can't even begin to fathom how that was interesting enough to keep your attention. Like, that was an exciting concept. Oh my god, dude. These kids are on my nuts. It's like no one else is in this match. Free fire, free fire, secure, secure, secure. Nice. What's better than Yellowstone? Outer range? Look this up. Anonymous Order tipped four dollars and ninety cents. Anonymous bought Smite season pass twenty twenty two from. Oh, this is like a brand new show. Out of range tells us an unnerving story about a rancher who experiences loads of supernatural occurrence. Okay, that's not at all in the same category. And I, I'm guessing the first episode of Outer Range doesn't have tits. Bouncing around in it, so categorically not the same and nowhere near as good. But I'll probably end up watching it at some point. Outer Range is not good. Eight episodes of not explaining anything. I see. I don't. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. I'll probably end up watching some of it if I get bored. I'll tell you. You personally enjoyed WandaVision because you enjoyed trying to figure out what was going on. I feel like it wasn't that deep, though. 
Am I... Am I trolling? What? What, what were you... What? Sometimes I feel like I just figure shit out way earlier than I'm meant to, too, and that can make a show a lot more boring to me. I haven't seen Moon Knight yet, no. The black and white episodes definitely uh, brought my opinion of the show down much quicker than maybe it should have, but yeah, I just, I don't know. Come back! Maybe come back. God damn it, dude. The 100 was good. Had a terrible season. One of the middle seasons, three or four, I don't remember what it was, was dog shit. But the rest of the show was good. I don't fuck with shows that are, like, somewhat plausible to, like, happen in some way, shape, or form. And then just throw magic into it. It's magic, like, like the real idea, not some kind of scientific, like, magic just jumps into a show. I think the show's fucking stupid instantly. If, if it jumps, you know what I mean? Not if it's like a magic show from the beginning, but if it jumps in, it's just like, it, it's there. I, which is what fucking that show did for a little bit. I thought it was so stupid. Have I watched Reacher? I've watched well, Reacher's God tier, bro. Reacher, the dude from fucking, uh, Thad, what's his name? What's the show? Blue Mountain State. Thad Castle's the main character in that shit. He is such a good actor in that fucking show. It's crazy how good he is in that show. Dude plays like a perfect badass, just not in the traditional badass. Like, it's traditional badass, I guess, in a way, but not quite the same. That show's good. Umbrella Academy, I thought was boring. I watched five, six episodes, and I'll never watch it again. I thought it was boring and kind of just not good. Yeah, I hope that the new Reacher show has just tons and tons of seasons, because that shit was... I just think it's that... That's a nuts for a good show, for a new show. Oh, they're right here. Yes, sir. <sighs> Why am I silenced? Timing, baby. Get the fucking cat off me. Do we even do this? See that synergy, baby? Mm. No, you, you can't get that synergy, dude. It takes takes many, many, many years. Bro, product. Wait. Are you not the same one asking that over and over and over again, Prodigy? Whoever, the, like 15 people have either asked about the 100 or the same person keeps asking. I've answered it four times. Stop asking about the show. If you're asking about it, fucking listen. I don't know if it was you, Prodigy. It might have been someone else with an orange name. Very possible. But I've answered the question like 15 times. Great show. One bad season. One terrible season. Destroyed a middle enemy phoenix. Till the hunt is called again. Oh my gosh! How much damage did he just take from me or did Mindy Ultima or something? What the fuck? He really raced. What's up, Basilisk? It's good, dude. How are you? I've watched a couple seasons of Mr. Robot. I randomly just stopped watching it. That's too bad. I think Thor is good this patch. I think he's okay. I think he's better than he was, but not actually really good. 
Like the gold. Oh shit. The golden blade character is still going to fuck you up, you know? Hey, Mindy tried to all and he was like 500 years away. Some random abilities don't have sound in this game. Somebody. Stranger Things, extremely overrated and overhyped. It's good. I think the upside down whole thing was just too much for me, like too weird and too just reaching, like really, really reaching to me. So like I'm not excited for the new season. I'm going to watch it, but uh, I don't know. Your team has it's a little too just like, I don't know, like pushing it, but not in a good way. Like, like, why? Why are we re like, why are we reaching? Grim, I saw, I was watching that when it was new. I thought it was decent. It wasn't a show I would ever binge. I wouldn't say it was a great show. It was decent. Craft Country? I don't know what that is. The Last Airbender? It was a god tier. It's a good show. See, I watched at, like that show when it was new. When it was on like Nickelodeon when I was young. I would watch it. So I'd seen a lot of it. I went back and watched it when it was popping on Netflix. And then I watched the second one. And uh, I thought the second one was better than people on stream were telling me. I thought it was really good. I've seen a couple seasons of Lucifer. Three of them, I think. It got really repetitive. And then the more I see of clips of it now, it's... it's it seems like it got pretty pretty in there for the concepts. Pretty out there, I guess, for the concepts. I thought he was a good actor and it was good, but... <sighs> what did I just watch? I just watched the show. Like a whole season. I watched it overnight. What the fuck? We, I was talking about... Oh, uh, Lincoln Lawyer. Lincoln Lawyer is pretty good. I thought Lincoln Lawyer was a good show. Started watching a show called The Wilds on Amazon. Why is this hard to end? I think I'm doing a fucking lot. That is so tanky. Your team has destroyed a middle enemy. This is Achilles. Achilles 2 is still one of the most broken abilities in Smite. Suits I don't think I've ever watched. I just learned what Love, Death, and Robots actually was about last night. I watched the little like intro trailer on uh, Netflix for it. I've never seen it before. The League is a great show. I was just talking about that. The League is an amazing show. Love that show.